aber. And there's the mum, always keeping an eye on them. But sometimes the mothers lose their babies and sometimes we need to help them because the mothers can't find their babies. And before I've taken seagulls to wet to vets and they ask you to make a donation to hand them in and it's best to leave them where they are and feed them yourself. So if you are lucky enough to have a baby seagull around your house, on your roof, close to where you live, then you feed that seagull and treat it like your cat, treat it like your dog. And that is how we help the baby seagulls. Because even though they can be a nuisance to us, people can be a nuisance to us. It doesn't mean we don't feed them. They're animals and they need our love. So when you see a seagull that's alone and needs love, then you be that person to give that seagull love. And you make a difference. You feed them like your cat. You feed them like your dog. And we love all animals. And it's Jaywick's way. So when you see a hungry seagull, a baby seagull, do the right thing and be a vet yourself and feed it. And that to me is a lovely thing to do. Shine on to all animals. Shine on to all creations. And love, love, love. That is all we need. Shine on everybody and love the baby seagulls. Love each other. Love everything. That is the answer.